the size of the suture um, can range from aught or zero to 11. The size, um, the larger the number, zero aught is the small, is the largest that you can use. Um, size 11 would be the smallest. Um, you're going to use somewhere between um, probably the 2.0 to the 4 range. Um, you want to make sure that you don't use too big a suture because it actually can alter the architecture of the tissue that you're attempting to suture. Um, 4.0 to 3.0 you can use in the skin or subcutaneous tissue. 3.0 to aught you can use in muscle or tendons. Um, 6.0 to 5.0 you can use in nerves or blood vessels. 5.0 to 2.0 you can use in um, intestines or hollow organs. And with the um, monofilaments are good to use because they, um, the multifilaments or braided will actually introduce bacteria into a contaminated environment. The monofilament or um, a suture such as monocryl you can use in rapidly healing tissues such as the subcutaneous or, or the urinary bladder. Um, the multifilaments um, can be used, you know, such as PDS, can be used in deep fascia such as muscles, um, the abdominal wall, or um, also for GI tissues. The surgical gut or chromic cat gut can be used um, can be used in the mouth, such as um, when you're taking when you're taking out um, when you're having extractions. And the nylon you can use in closing the skin. And the PDS you can also use, um, as such as in spays and neuters. Um, silk is used for um, you can use in the muscle or connective or epithelial tissue. Um, it's a multifilament. And for fascias and tendons, they can be closed with non-absorbable sutures or absorbable. Um, stomach, colon, or bladder can be closed with absorbable sutures.